Hey guys, today I'm gonna show you how to create a game in Python. It's by the way a silly game, but I thought I would just um, create it into code in Python and it would be great to transfer your knowledge into code whenever you feel like uh, you want to do so. So let's get started. First of all, what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna explain the what the game does. The game is just about you are going to type your first letter of your name and the computer is going to guess your name. So for example, suppose that your name is John, you are going to type the first name the first letter of your of your name which is J and the computer will have some kind of a list or a database and it's going to uh, loop through all of these names and going to guess the name and then uh, bring that name to you and asks you if it's true or not. So let's get started. First of all, first of all, suppose that the computer has a list that is equal to a uh, name, a variable that is equal to name, and it has many names. For example, uh, John, and then uh, Matthew, and then uh, I don't know, Kate and also uh, Jack. So you can you can fill this uh, list with uh, a limitless number of, uh, of different names and the more names you have the better because you would go through the because your guess the computer uh, the computer's guess will be uh, accurate if you have many uh, names. And the second thing that you need to, to, to do is to ask the user to enter their first letter. So first letter equals to input and you should ask the user please enter or enter your first letter of your name of your name, right? And then what you would do is you would just loop through all of the names and then guess uh, and then get the first letter of each name and compare it with the one that the user has typed in. So for example, I am going to create a for loop and then x in the names or the name, the list of names. And then if the first letter, which is uh, which is uh, which is this one, equals to the first letter the first letter of e of any of these we are going to equals to the first letter the first letter we are going to print that name to the user right so I'm gonna print that name print that name which is equal to X so it's gonna loop through the first one and it's going to guess if the first letter of of the uh, of that lit uh, of uh, of that name equals to the one that the user has typed. If that is true, it's gonna print it to the user and then asks the user if it's true or not. So here I'm gonna create another input which is going to uh, computer guess guess equals to input and it's gonna be equal to is that true? Is that true? True. And you should answer this question with a yes or no. So if again, if that com computer guess is equal equals yes, you should type yes. Of course, if if it's true, what we would do is print uh, print something silly. So for example, uh, some laugh or something, ha ha, anything like that. And then if that is not true, else, else the computer should guess uh, again uh, with another name. So it's, it's first going to the first name and make that guess. If it's not true, it's gonna get, uh, it's gonna get to the next one and so on and so forth. So if it's not true, we are going to print one, two, three, four, print, uh, well, I'm gonna try again or something, well, uh, anything silly, I don't know. Uh, just get creative and create your own uh, print 
uh, stuff here and then uh, that's it so it's gonna first of all it's gonna get to it's gonna ask the user here enter your first letter of your name and for example if I type uh, K and it's gonna hear uh, implement this loop and it's gonna get to the first one and of course the first one the first uh, name doesn't have a first letter equals to K so it's gonna leave it and and uh, it's gonna get to the second one it doesn't have as well so it's gonna get to the third one and asks me if that is true or not if that is true it is going to say uh, it's gonna ask me if it's true if I say yes it's gonna print this uh, ha 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 uh, string <laughs> or if it's not true it's gonna uh, try again so let's uh, let me just rearrange this I'm gonna just put the John in the second place John and let's run let's run this and let's run it here so what I'm gonna do is just type Python and then the name of the file which is name underscore guest dot py hit enter and here as you can see enter your first letter of your name so for example my name is John or, or Jack so you would just type J and hit enter and it's gonna first of all it's gonna type John because it's the first one in the array that it comes first and it has a letter uh, of J at the beginning and it's gonna ask me is that true I would say no because my name is Jack and hit enter and it's gonna type well and goes again and perform the loop for the second time and asks me uh, Jack uh, and it's gonna ask me uh, is that true I would say yes and hit enter and it says ha 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 which is uh, f uh, which is very silly I just wanted to play uh, I just wanted to transfer this uh, game this idea into code and it's by the way it's a very good way to learn coding by transferring your ideas and uh, games and stuff like that into code it's a very good way to learn coding so that's it for this tutorial uh, don't forget to share like and subscribe and by the way guys check the description below because I have a free ebook that is going to help you make money coding and also if you want to um, take your um, skills in programming further I have created a very ad advanced uh, courses in uh, different Python uh, areas and other programming languages so that you can take your skills to the next level and get a job in one of the biggest companies in the world. So that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later.